A Higley High, uh, they are spotlighting their volleyball program. And this is really is unique. Nice. Is it sand? Or, I thought or it was. On the court? I think it may be boys indoor season now. It's, uh, Renee will get us going, but yeah. I know it's girls sand season. It is. That's just started. Hey, Renee. Hey, good Renee. morning. Hey guys, yeah, so we're out at Higley High School. Troy, you're right. Uh, the boys' season has just started, so they are the defending state champions. Of course, they are looking to defend their title, and I'm talking to a couple of the boys' coaches here this morning. Uh, the season's just started. How are they doing so far? Uh, we struggled in our first match, but we're getting ready for our next match today. We have a big tournament this weekend, and it should be good for us to get our systems right, our team to be in the right place, and get ourselves to be the best team possible. Big changes since last year when you guys won state? A lot of changes. We've switched f uh, six kids into different spots. A lot of our, our four main scorers are not on our team anymore. They're se they were seniors last season. We have a bunch of kids stepping up into bigger roles. Okay, so this is huge for you guys to defend your state title, but they're out here having a good time too. What, what kind of things are we teaching the kids when they're out here? Um, most importantly, just have fun. Go out there, learn something new, have fun, and get better every single day. That's what we're trying to do. And everyone looks like they've got great attitudes out here and a whole lot of skill, but we're also talking about girls' sand beach volleyball. That's new this year, is that right? Yes, it's completely new to Higley. We've had the court for a few years, but this is the first time we're actually going out there and trying. So we're competing in Division 6A with all the other schools who have had sand volleyball for a while, and we're just going to try to get our names out there. How do the girls feel about it, going from you know being inside to being outside? Um, it's a lot of adjustments. The girls have a few things to learn from indoor to sand volleyball, but they're excited, they're energetic, and they're confident after our first game yesterday, so it's been going well so far. Okay, any jealousy, though? I mean, come on. The girls get to be outside, they get to be on the beach court. Any jealousy from the guys that are like, well, what about us? Uh, I think they're jealous for right now, but when it gets hot outside, they're going to be pretty happy they're inside. That's a good point. But check out all of these athletes, guys. Um, they're pretty incredible. So we've been talking to uh, a couple of them here. And can I get your name? Uh, Parisa Garcia. And what team do you play on? Uh, I play on the freshman team at Higley High School. And are you doing the sand volleyball or the? I'm doing both. I'm doing sand and court. What do you like better? Um, I like court I like... better, but I just started sand. So it's, a, it's an adventure. So. Yeah? yeah? A lot of good people on your team? Yeah, of course. Yeah. All right. Well. The Lady Knights, thank you so much. Guys, we're going to uh, see what else these guys can do because they run a lot of drills. They do a lot of stuff. I mean, Troy, you, you've you watched a lot of this. Well, Andrew actually you coached my daughter when she was uh, 11 or 12, the first guy you talked to over there. Look at that. Yeah. Oh, yeah, and get out. Here's Just one thing I will tell way. you. Yeah. You catch a volleyball what? to the head, it's, it's no joke. Yeah. Yeah, I'm Serious not kidding. Stuff. Even when they're just peppering yeah. around there. So, yeah, don't turn your back on a volleyball court. That's Boys volleyball, boy, I tell you, the, the power and the athletics. Oh, well, oh, what did she just well, do? Well, then she just served it up, and then he went ahead and hit it. <laughs> is that, is that an, uh, an assist? I think so. Sure, we'll give her that. 8.30 this morning, Renee's. So, uh, I, you know what? I don't know how Higley, got, Higley High has their PR person having us out there for volleyball. Yeah, what's it's pretty impressive. Here? I got to get Corona's, uh, you know, PR person on this because, uh, yeah, all these great volleyball programs. Hi, Renee. Hey, Renee. Hey, hey, guys. Okay, so we're out here. We're playing a little friendly competition, which is always friendly out here at Higley High School. Uh, this competition, what is a mix between volleyball and basketball? So I'm going to toss the ball up and decide who gets to. Uh, well, you're both going to start here. Girls, go! Come on, let's go! Let's go! All right, so the competition here, they're going to try and get that volleyball actually into a net. That's not what we normally do here, playing uh, but, volleyball. Look how close they, I mean, it's pretty tremendous how close they're getting. It's true, that's true. So I'm with Principal Diab Scott this morning. Uh, come on, the first thing you told me, which I just think is hilarious, is how hard it is to maintain your voice during the volleyball season. Absolutely. I usually lose my voice by the first match because I'm screaming so loud for these kids. They are absolutely incredible on the court. I've watched both boys and girls, and they truly show everything. When we talk about Higley Pride and the Higley family, they put it all out there on the court, and they give their best every single time. This is a big ship that you run here, and you've got a lot of kids out here, but they seem like they are 
just a great bunch. Tell me a little bit about them. Our students here at Higley High School really, our motto is united in excellence and honor, and that is truly what every single one of these students here exemplifies, both on the field, in the court, and in the classroom. So I, I'm truly honored to be the principal here and work with these wonderful students and with the amazing staff here. Uh, the, and they have been great this morning, too, and really competitive. So you guys are defending state champions. Uh, a message for the other schools, maybe, that are coming up against you guys. We're ready. We're defending state champions. We are ready to get back on the court and win it again. Go Knights! See? Go Knights! You can tell. Uh, you got that whistle on you? Because that is intimidating. Okay, she doesn't. But go Knights! Uh, a lot of people out here this morning, and they're working hard. Guys, you got to work a little harder. Work harder! You're, what? Trump 2020. Is this in politics? Go Knights? Yeah, Trump 2020. Go, go Knights? Knights? Go Knights, yeah. Sure. Go Knights! Go Knights! Go Knights! Hey, Renee. Go Knights! Can you hear me, Renee? There we go. Your can mama you, tells you, you to me? be loud. It should be easier. Hello. Can you hear me, Renee? Hello? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Can you grab yes. a, the varsity boy setter? and the varsity outside and have them show us one attack. Yes, that would be great to that, see them spike the ball. Because that shows you to okay. grab the varsity setter okay. and the varsity, varsity outside hitter. Varsity boys setter. And the varsity outside hitter. And the varsity boys outside hitter. And do, do one attack. And I need you to show me an attack. One. Okay, let's go, let's go. Where are they? Okay. You guys ready? Hold on. Hold on one second. Let, uh, let your photojournalist get up it. there. Yeah. Okay, we're deciding who's going to do what. Okay, tell them they got about ready? 10 seconds. What do we do? Jacob. Who needs the ball? These guys, they jump out of the gym. Up. Yeah. Okay. Here we go. He's got Let's a ball. Go. We got it? Okay. Get into court? All right. All right, here we go. Watch how this happens. Is that your center? Okay, number nine is going to put that ball up and he's going to put it up to his outside. Who's the outside? Is it 18? Okay. Must be, huh? All right, seven. here we go. Here we go. Now watch. Oh, one more time. One more. Yeah, come one on. More. One more time. One more time. It's a pretty good set. One more time. Yeah, I thought that was a that was a hittable set. Yeah, it was. Outside. I'm a dad <laughs> of a setter. <laughs> yeah, there you go. One more time. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, wow. Come on, guys. Let's right, here go. we go. Here we go. Oh, nice. that's what I'm talking about right well there. Well done, well done. Try to dig that's that on uh -huh. the teams. Right there. Good stuff, yeah. Thank right you, Renee. There. Thank Good you, stuff. Renee. That's when you're in the background and you're just like this, right? Oh, oh. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it can.